Arkansas-based group is now helping small businesses tap into the promises of the lithium industry. Teen 3 11's Maya Ellison spoke with the people behind Startup Junkies for an idea how the plan they plan to lead the charge for the rechargeable mineral. We want to make sure that we're providing awareness and providing all the opportunities for the people in the community. Startup Junkie is no stranger to helping entrepreneurs prepare for the future, but these days they're helping small businesses tap into a big industry. Essentially what it is, it's a public-private partnership to bring together active, participate, active participants in a region to sort of work together and develop and grow an industry. The Fayetteville-based company is one of 14 chosen for the U.S. Small Business Administration's Regional Innovation Cluster. With that help, SBA officials say Startup Junkie will, quote, support small businesses in leveraging lithium for the clean energy and electric vehicle transition across northeast Texas, southern Arkansas, northern Louisiana, and west Mississippi. The overall goal for us is to provide opportunities for people especially along the lithium supply chain. The announcement comes just a week after the Arkansas Department of Energy and Environment and United States Geological Survey released a new study outlining the possible discovery of somewhere between 5 and 19 million tons of lithium located in an area called the Smackover Formation. While lithium production is nothing new for major companies like Exxon, Mobil, and Albemarle, Matthew Ward says entrepreneurs and small businesses can also have a seat at the table. Are the number of small businesses within the cluster growing? Is their revenue growing? Are they getting access to federal funding opportunities to um, help fund their commercialization efforts? Also known as white gold, lithium can be used in air treatment, batteries, electric vehicles, or even equipment for soldiers in the battlefield once it's extracted. When we reached out to USGS hydrologist Catherine Kinernum on the importance of the metal, she said, quote, lithium was and still is seen as a strategic mineral commodity that could contribute towards U.S. energy independence, an avenue the country once led up until the 1980s. We think this could be a great way to have sort of mind share from different people mm -hmm. across different walks of life and be able to have sort of that mentality of rising tides brings up all ships. In Little Rock, Maya Ellison, THV 11 News. Thank you, Maya. The SBA is just the start to opening doors for small businesses to play a hand in the state's lithium growth. Colleges like Arkansas Tech University have worked to implement lithium courses for students to gain insight of the industry.